taking the bus as part of your morning routine, you probably notice it's a bit more crowded when you hop on the Port Authority ride. Megan Schiller joins us now with a look at why the problem may not be so easy to solve. Good morning. It seems like it would be a good problem to have, right? Except for the fact that you would think they would just want to buy more buses, but buses are very expensive, and they also are now saying to our news partners at the Pittsburgh Post Gazette, the Port Authority does not have enough room in their garage space to even house any more buses if they wanted that to be the solution for the overcrowding. They told the Post Gazette that the garage already has 720 vehicles inside of it, so that's not going to fix the problem. The Port Authority's annual report shows more and more bus rides lately are being filled beyond the seating capacity. The percentage increased from 2017 to 2018 by 9% of rides. In the meantime, to try to solve the problem, Port Authority says it's going to be reviewing bus schedules and also testing out a time limit on how many people can get on the bus at any one stop in order to prevent overcrowding and essentially making people wait at the stop for the next bus to come instead of having the bus sit there and wait for everyone to squeeze on. The busiest Port Authority bus, the one that is essentially has the many most people squished in they said took 9,000 rides over seating capacity so they said that that is something they are definitely going to be working to change in the coming months we are live this morning Megan Schiller KDK News